Nowadays, the profession of being a football player is extremely popular. And the biggest stars in this discipline have fans right across the world. So you might think that people like that have tons of friends that they can rely on. Unfortunately, the reality is considerably different. And most players, in fact, have a really narrow circle of friends. Take the PSG player Neymar, for example. In today's episode, we're going to answer the question, who exactly are Neymar's friends? So sit back, relax, and don't go anywhere. The Brazilian superstar often posts pictures of himself surrounded by a group of friendly people on his social media profiles. But they're not exactly regular friends who have known Neymar for years. In fact, they're called the Toys, nicknamed from a song by a Brazilian pop star. Translated into English, it means it's us. So, what exactly do the Toys do every day? One member of this group, Gustavo Almeida, described it in this way. We're around Neymar every day to make his life better and easier. We protect him from the surrounding stress. When we hang out, we don't talk about football. We simply have fun, travel and enjoy the time we get to spend together. We act as an escape from all the stress. We do talk a lot, but never about football. On average, a single member of the Toys earns around 4,000 to 6,000 euros per month. However, different sources give various numbers, with the highest one stating that they could earn up to 11,000 euros per month. So that begs the question, who pays the Toys? Well, actually, they're a part of Neymar's contract with the team. On one hand, these friends keep Neymar's morale up and do everything to make him feel good in a new environment. On the other hand, the toys can sometimes lead him down the wrong path. The 442 journalist Andrew Murray was supposed to interview the Brazilian back when he was playing for FC Barcelona. He says, We were in Barcelona waiting for the arranged interview with Neymar. As time went on, he was two to three hours late. The staff at the Camp Nou kept restocking snacks and drinks for us, making sure that we were kept comfortable and didn't starve. But as time went on, he wasn't showing up. He did eventually arrive around 9pm, a massive nine hours late. He turned up without a care in the world, and when he got out of his car, it looked like a massive party. He showed up with a dozen toys, blasting Brazilian music from his portable speakers. Apparently they were late because of a barbecue that they decided to throw. And from what we understand, this type of behaviour is common from the Brazilian star. In fact, many players from this country have a lot of temper and can be difficult to deal with at times. So who are the members of the toys? They're mostly people who come from Brazil's poor districts, or didn't have luck in life. Being a part of the Toys is a gift of fate, a chance for a better life. Getting to spend time with Neymar is not the only positive of the job. They also get to date beautiful models, drive fancy cars and spend time on luxurious and very expensive yachts. On the other hand, you can never mention football and losing your job is really easy. So we can only imagine how many people dream of a job like this, getting paid to be friends with a football star. So that concludes today's video. And remember, we invite all football fans to join our free browser game, footballteamgame.com. You can find a link in the description. Apart from that, thanks so much for watching, guys, and we'll see you on the next video.